today I am at Magic Kingdom. Hello friends, it's Mia. Yes, today it's only Mia. My sidekick Ricky is not here today. Anyway, what am I doing here today? I don't know. I think I needed a break. I needed to come out in this 91 degree weather and just have a magical day. So I hope you'll join me. Let's go, it's gonna be fun. That I promise you. These sights and sounds of Disney's Magic Kingdom. So where is our first like stop today? We are gonna walk through Adventureland and we're gonna head over to Frontierland. That's where we're going first. There's a lot of people here today. I don't know why there's a lot of people here today, but there is. Uh, it is Friday. And that may be the reason. But no, because sometimes you can be here on a Tuesday or a Wednesday and it's busy as heck. So, anyway. So let's head on over there and see what's happening in Frontierland. I think our first stop is getting ourselves a Dole Whip. Because it's hot and the Dole Whip is delicious and refreshing too. There are four types of Dole Whip you can get. We have the pineapple upside down cake Dole Whip, tropical serenade and Dole Whip. too much in mind like I never planned on getting this today but here we go Ricky eat your heart out okay that wasn't very nice he's gonna want one of these okay next time anyway we're gonna head over to Tiana's Bayou Adventure and see what's happening here oh I see some water Let's see what's going on let's go so there goes the logs they seem to be moving very slowly. I don't think they're coming down on the big splash mountain. But, oh, did I say splash mountain? Oh, I mean Tiana's Bayou Adventure. All right, let's go check and see if they're uh, coming down um, on that mountain. Okay, there's some glare there, but nothing's going on. There's no water uh, coming down the mountain, so they are not testing today. They have the logs down here and some water down here, but that's about it. So we're gonna get a little closer and we're gonna go see the side view of Tiana's Bayou Adventure. I wanna see if they changed anything, if they put any new signs here since last I was here with Ricky. And it looks like they did, so let's check it out. So it looks pretty good here at the train station. So you can see well, all the way in the back, there's the Tiana store back there, but uh, we're not going back there today. We're gonna, I don't think we can go back there today. Okay, so Critter Co-op, so they put these little signs and they say this way. So yeah, okay, so it's looking a little bit different than Splash Mountain did. Here's some of the house rules. All critters welcome. There's no such thing as a wrong no. Dress quote, dress quote, dress code swamp casual. Uh, could that be, that's Cousin Randy? I thought it was Ray for a minute there, but Cousin Randy looks um, a lot chubbier than uh, Ray does. I know Brer Rabbit moved out, but I'm not sure who's occupying this residence. So someone's missing in here. It says they're coming back right after Mardi Gras. 
Well, I'm thinking Tiana's Bayou adventure is coming along pretty well. What do you guys think? Well, what's happening down here? It looks like they're having a hoedown. Let's go, ladies and gents. Let's go to the hoedown. <laughs> the hoedown I love it you know you it starts at 6 sometimes it starts at 5 30 depending on the time of the year but uh, or it could start at another time because oh hold on <laughs> Disney changes things around here so uh, anyway but I'm glad we caught that that was unexpected let's uh, now Leave Liberty Square, that's where we are at, and head into Fantasyland. There's Rapunzel's tower. I wonder if she's going to let down her golden hair today. Sometimes she's around here. No, Rapunzel's not around. I guess Mother has her locked up in the tower. Either that or she's on an adventure with Lynn Ryder. Hopefully it's a second one. So we're at the castle today because we were invited to go see some Because I hear she's having a ball. Oh, someone very special by the name of Byron Chandler, who turns 35 today. Happy birthday, Byron. Okay, so we're going to go see Cinderella. Let's see what time the ball starts tonight. If you have not seen Byron Chandler's channel, I will leave a link below in the description box and you can check out his channel when you get a chance. Look at the detail here inside the castle. Here are all the portraits of the princesses. Here's the other side with more of the princesses. There's Cinderella's glass slipper. Look how beautiful. There is a huge treat here today. I see Cinderella, but I also see Snow White here. Maybe we'll have time to see both princesses. Oh, how exciting. I've never seen Snow here with Cinderella. It's always been Elena. Yeah, it's Elena. Yeah, Elena. Hello, beautiful Cinderella. Okay, Cinderella, my friend Byron loves you. And it's his 35th birthday today. Yeah, and he asked that if he can have you spin and curtsy for him, will you do that for his birthday? Okay, let me step back and get that for him. Byron, this is for you. Wonderful. Thank you, Cinderella. Oh, he will see this video. Thank you. Thank you.
ladies and gentlemen, it's Snow White. Oh, hello there. Everybody's watching Snow. What are, who are we talking to? Oh, all the people out there in TV land. Wonderful. Well, hello everyone. Yeah. You, my seven little friends, are hard at work in the mines right now. But it's just about time for their dinner, so I'll have to run out. I've got a good gooseberry pie in the oven. I'm feeling really nice about this one. I added extra sugar, just like Ruffy likes. Oh, that's wonderful, Snow. Thank you so much, and have fun. And I'll go stop in and go see the seven dwarfs. Oh, wonderful. Thank Thanks. you. I'll to get ready for dinner. Yes, I hope they leave me some of the pie. Oh, yes, of course. Bye-bye, <laughs> Snow. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Okay, wasn't that fun? Oh, my goodness. How fun is that? If you guys don't know by now, I love the princesses. Did you see Cinderella teaching me how to curtsy and spin around? Did I do a great job? If I did, you guys, give it a thumbs up, please. You know, I deserve that. The Cinderella deserves it too for trying to teach me. Anyway, um, we're here. We're going to go see the Seven Dwarfs. And because Snow White recommended we see them, so we're going to go see the Seven Dwarfs. vintage, very retro um, colors. The turquoise, skyish blue, turquoise -y color uh, with the orange. I love it. I love that the monorail is here and you have the people mover and you, Tron I'm not such a fan of, but he's here. Yeah, the Tron ride is right there. And right there is Space Mountain. I do like this bag. Let's see how much it is. Let's see, I don't have my glasses on, so there's the price right there. So here's the Tomorrowland jersey, $79.99. Let's check out the uh, front. Very cool. Very, very cool. I like this. So I do like the collection. The ears have sold out, but they should be getting some more ears in allegedly so we'll see what happens I'd like to take a look at those ears see if I need them now I don't need anything it just depends if I want them anyway in the summer I don't wear the ears it's too hot out today you see I wear my little hat here yeah my little neck band it's a little too hot for me today and it's only going to get hotter from here. But okay, we're here by the people mover. Let's see if the people mover is moving people today. We finally made it to the people mover after 10 minutes. Here we go. Aboard the people mover, presented by Enterprise. I'm Mark Bonnick, your guide aboard this highway in the sky. The absolute best way to see Tomorrowland. And my stars, there are ever lots to see. From spacecraft to monster lives. There's really nothing like today in Tomorrowland. Attention, people of the and Earth. For your safety, you may remain seated with hands on the and legs inside your vehicle at all times. And think about things may occur. But I know she will begin immediately. Thank you. 
like Walt Disney's amazing dream for a community of tomorrow. Did you know Progress City inspired Epcot? And a lot of the visionary ideas throughout Walt Disney World. has brought in some real monsters of comedy. Whether you have one eye or nine, take the time to see this show. It's been such a wonderful trip by myself today. So there's Cinderella's castle peeking through the trees. So we have to walk through the forest until we get there. Or we cut, cut over from Tomorrowland and walk on pavement. Here's another view of Cinderella Castle. We're gonna go around this way because we're gonna head over to the wishing well and make a wish for Byron. And since you all are here today with me, we are going to make wishes for ourselves too. So let's check out the side of Cinderella Castle right there. Look at how beautiful, look at the water. And there's the castle. Stunning. So we have some bad news. The fireworks start in an hour, but they closed off the area, so I can't get to the wishing well, but we're gonna get as close as possible with the camera. And we're gonna make our wish from here. So Byron, are you ready to make your wish? Everybody out there, are you ready to make your wish? Because here we go, we're gonna make our wishes. And then, when they all come true, well, well, another time, just let me know what your wish was and if it came true. So there is Cinderella's wishing well. Everybody, make a wish. Here's another beautiful view of the castle. Right here between two of the bushes. Bubbles are everywhere here. Ooh, bubbles, bubbles. Okay, so these are all fantastic views. I need to get back into fantasy land, but we can't go through this area because they blocked it all off. So, I don't know. I need to get to that Cinderella water fountain. Yeah. Anyway, while we're waiting, let's film the front of the castle. Here's the front of the gorgeous, most majestic castle at Disney. And it's Cinderella's castle. Look at all this. Look at the kingdom, you guys. So we had to go all around and we're gonna go through Liberty Square. They did close off all the area, but we do get a nice view here. Cinderella Castle. So pretty, the reflection in the water. Gee, I'm a little hungry. All I had today was that pineapple dole whip, vanilla dole whip, and a banana. Oh, and some peanut butter on that banana. That's how I like my banana with peanut butter. So I'm a little hungry. I don't know if I'll get something to eat here or wait till I get home. Ah, we shall see. Let's play it by ear. So we're passing Mento Mori. There is really nothing new in Mento Mori to um, scream about. And right here is your haunted mansion. The haunted mansion is not too busy tonight. With all those foolish mortals waiting to get in, it's not very busy. It looks like the lanterns are getting ready to be sent off. One of Rapunzel's favorite things in the whole world are the lanterns. I would say it's mine too. 
I love the lanterns, seeing the lanterns in the sky. That's my favorite, favorite scene really of the movie. Not when she clocks them with the frying pan. No. When right up with the frying pan, clock. Oh well. <laughs> anyway, not, that's not my favorite scene in the movie. It's the lantern scene. Yeah. Too bad we haven't seen we didn't see Rapunzel today. Next time we'll catch Rapunzel another day. So my friends, we are getting a uh, video of the carousel and we cannot make our way to the back of Cinderella Castle because it is closed off for happy ever after so we cannot get to the water fountain okay well like they say there's always a next time Okay, so let's head on back to Main Street. Should I get a turkey leg? They look mighty yummy. What do you guys think? No, I'm not gonna get a turkey leg today. I'm not in the mood for that. It's too big. The last time I got a turkey leg was, I don't know, before, you know, the pandemic thing. Yeah, I like this one too. And I was with Ricky. And yes. He can polish that off, but it's pretty big, and uh, I can't do it. I'll eat like, I don't know, a quarter of that, and then I'm done. Anyway, so we're not getting there tonight. Let's keep heading towards Main Street, see what else we find. The fireworks are going to begin in 30 minutes, but we are going to do a little shopping because, hey, 30 minutes. Find some merch I may need to take home. So we're here at the Emporium. And what do I see that's new? Nothing. Nothing to report back. So uh, we're gonna go outside and maybe we'll catch some of the um, fireworks. Oh, you know what I was looking for, you guys? I was looking for the plane to park in. It looks like they're all sold out everywhere. So I don't know. I'll check Disney Springs next week and see if they have any there. Bye! Have a magical evening! Thank you for watching. Have a magical evening.